All right, guys. Uh, we're all set. Uh, we've got the much-awaited India versus Australia series coming up. We're just starting off the series in about a day's time. Uh, we've got the India eleven. Uh, we've got the Australia eleven, and we've also got the much-awaited. Everyone is looking forward to it. The uh, fantasy eleven. Uh, to start with, I'm going to start off with the host. I'm going to start off with Australia. Uh, my eleven would be for Australia. I'm going to have a look. I'm going to start off with uh, Marcus Harris. I'm going to have Aaron Finch. I'm going to have Usman Khawaja, the only batsman who looks in good nick for me. Uh, Sean Marsh, Travis Head, a left-hander, Mitchell Marsh, an all-rounder gives me options of batting and bowling. Uh, Tim Payne, the captain, goes without saying. Mitchell Stark, to me, he's a trump card. Uh, Pat Cummins, Nathan Lyon, and Josh Hazelwood. And I picked Nathan Lyon because obviously he's been brilliant over the years, and also I get a feeling the ball will turn at Adelaide. And now to the Indian side, uh, I've got uh, uh, Purli Vijay. Uh, yes, he's done exceedingly. Uh, he's done exceedingly well in the past. He's done exceedingly well in Australia. Yes, he's not had a great time in England and in South Africa, but I do get a feeling he's hungry. He's got the desire. I've got KL Rahul. I probably might have had Prithvi Shaw in front of him, but all. Everyone knows that Prithvi Shaw does not fit in at the moment because of his injury. At number three, Pujara. Number four, Captain Kohli. Uh, number five, Ajinkya Rahane. At number six, uh, no, no, it's not Rohit Sharma. To me, it's still Hanuman Vihari. Uh, number seven, the dynamic wicketkeeper Rishabh Pant. Uh, number eight uh, would be Ravi Chandran Ashwin. Uh, number nine would be uh, uh, Ishan Sharma. Number ten, Mohammad Shami. And number eleven, Jasprit Bumrah. And finally, to my uh, fantasy eleven, uh, the side that I would look to go with uh, to start with. Uh, let's do the keeper. Let's just do the keeper first. Rishabh Pant is my keeper. Uh, to me, the batsmen uh, in the side would be uh, Amurli Vijay. Uh, again, as I said, I back him in Australia. He's done well there. I back a KL Rahul. He's also done well in Australia. He's got his first Test hundred in Australia. Uh, I'm also looking at picking. Uh, Just the lone Aussie batsman in the batsman, just one, just one, and that's Usman Khawaja. Uh, then I've got, uh, but obviously, captain. I wouldn't say the captain of the fantasy eleven, but I just say captain because I like calling him Captain Kohli. It's Virat Kohli. Uh, the all-rounders. Uh, I'm, I'm picking two. I'm not just picking one for the simple reason that with the fantasy eleven, the more roles someone can play, the more points you can get. So I'm going to be, I'm going to be picking. A uh, Ravi Chandran Ashwin, and I'm also going to be picking a uh, Mitchell Marsh. Uh, to me, the bowlers will be uh, left-arm Seema, serious fast bowler Mitchell Stark, uh, Jasprit Bumrah, the guy who has to do the trick for India, uh, uh, Josh Hazelwood, again somebody who's done exceedingly well in Australia, and the lone spinner. Yes, we've already got Ashwin as an all-rounder, but the lone spinner for me will be Nathan Lyon. And now to the captain of the side of the Fantasy Eleven. Uh, Normally, I would pick an all-rounder, a guy who would do dual roles, but I would still go with the Virat Kohli simply because I think he's hungry. I think he's done well there, and for me, someone like him will give you double the points, and I'm looking forward to 100 from him. So it's again King Kohli. So this is my side. Hope you guys make the most of it, and let's see where we all end up.